this is right. Dude should be getting water. Unless... Okay, um... Water needs to go into there. This this is hard. <laughs> Maybe I need the water to go outside for some reason. go see what it does outside first. I might need that. I think I found out what I needed that coal for. I think. I'm hoping I can finish all these puzzles up before I have to call it a night. Perfect. Alright, now the water is flowing back in. Aha! I had it right. Alright, I have suspenders. But what do I need the suspenders for? Therein lies the question. Dear Mr. Donstow, I have been held in a prisoner. Dear Meister Donstow, I have been held in a prisoner of war camp in Rhymes for almost three months now. We are relatively well treated, but I can't wait to get out of here. With your permission, at the end of the war, I would very much like to return to my foreman position. I still have all my faculties, and even if I may not be as strong as I was, I'd soon be fit enough to work again. I look forward to hearing from you. Maximilian, electrician foreman. I'd wager, especially for German soldiers, you'd have trouble getting back into work. Okay, the pipe's up there, but this jerkwad isn't going to let me by. Alright, he's telling me to bugger off. So. Sick dude in the laundry mat. I need to get this to him. 
and the laundry mat was right over here. If I, yep, here it is. Life in prisoner of war camps, even in captivity, class difference still counted. Some camps were underfed, even more so if the local population population was also undernourished. Prisoner, prisoners of war replaced civilians at the front and were forced to work in munition factories on farms or down mines. <laughs> Take it, dude. <laughs> Trophy earned. Help me, helpful laundryman. Just a second. Push all the laundry bags. Okay, whatever. All right, I got, aha! I got my bandana now, I'm one of the boys. They should let me up the steps now. The ladder, I mean. That way I can get the pipe, give it to the cook, and then I can, Get the meat. I wonder what the red bandana signifies. If it signifies anything at all. Okay, they won't let me inside, so... worth a try. Hmm. What's this? Biscuit box. Prisoners suffered from hunger in camps and food was often stolen. This metal box was handmade to contain bread or biscuits. Its owner could take his food reserves with him when he went to work to avoid them being stolen. Show makes perfect sense. All right, I have to get this angle just right. I just screw this up. Alright, I can't pull it any further. Just to see if I can do it.
Oh, I get it. I have the meat. Quite literally. Alright, where's my girl? The fallen dogs going for you. Alright, I gotta wait for a certain period of time to do all of this. Alright, it's saving. Alright, I'm gonna have to call it here for the night. And I just realized that that's Anna's father. Anyway, I'm trying to escape with Anna's father. And uh, thank you very much for watching on this playthrough of Valiant Hearts The Great War. I hope you're enjoying it. And if you want to see more Valiant Hearts, you can go to my YouTube page. My YouTube page is the same as my Twitch, PlayStation, and Steam name. It's Bonsai0311. And if you want to play any games with me on PlayStation or Steam, uh, send me a friend request. I'll gladly accept. I'm always looking for more games and new friends to play them with. Anyway, until tomorrow night, like, link, subscribe, do the whole social thing. And as always, I will see you in the next playthrough. Later.